the battle to keep Britain united as it prepares to leave the EU. Well, it continues today with a definite date for Brexit announced. Theresa May says she wants the best possible deal for all parts of the UK. Meanwhile, Scottish politicians begin two days of debate on whether to back First Minister Nicola Sturgeon's call for a second independence referendum. We'll speak to our political editor, Randy Singh, at Westminster in a moment. But first, our correspondent, Nick Dixon, is outside Holyrood in Edinburgh. Uh, Nick, the Prime Minister may want a deal for all parts of the UK, but that is not what the SNP wants. So how much support does Nicola Sturgeon have for her plan for a second referendum? Well, morning, Piers. Only from the Green Party here in Scotland, the Scottish Conservatives, Labour, uh, Lib Dems have all said they'll try and block the ballot when it happens on Wednesday afternoon after the two days of debating. But listen, above and beyond that, in the polls so far, not a single poll has shown that a majority of Scottish people actually wants an independence referendum. Go back to the first one just a few years ago. It was an incredibly divisive and unsettling time for entire families, entire communities. And not many people will relish the prospect of that sort of independence uh, referendum happening again. So this could be a tough sell uh, for Nicola Sturgeon. Certainly today at the Scottish Parliament, it's going to be very feisty and very passionate uh, with these debates. And the Prime Minister will be watching very closely. 